near Halt Bay in the Western Cape. That fire destroyed more than 500 structures and left thousands displaced. Another fire at KT section at Kailicha on the Cape Flats left nearly 100 people homeless. This brings to nine the number of people killed in fires in the province since Christmas Day. Familiar scenes at Imizamoyetu. Smoke, burnt corrugated iron and debris. More than 500 shacks razed to the ground. 59-year-old Nobizodwa Jomba did not only lose her home and belongings, but her 25-year-old son too. My child had burned to ashes when his siblings found him. They managed to identify that it was him because of the head. Otherwise, there was nothing left of him. Had the firefighters listened that there was someone trapped there, maybe he could have been saved. It's a bleak festive period for this community. The sad reality is that some of the families are in Eastern Cape somewhere else enjoying holidays. They'll learn of the sad news via relatives and other close friends. So they're not here to witness and to save whatever belongings that they could save. At KT section in Kailicha, 26 shacks also burnt down and 76 people were displaced. Residents say this is the third shack fire at Imizamoye to this year. The last one swept through the informal settlement just three weeks ago. Again, leaving thousands of people homeless and traumatized. It was a bleak Christmas for families living here and prospects for the new year are not looking good either. The city says it will assist families where it can. Numa Oto Solwante, SABC News, Imizamoyetu.